Hello everyone, I am Shyam Pasari and welcome to Asian Academy. So as you can see from the title of this video, in this video we will solve another question and the question is as follows, what is the number of digits in the number 1024 raised to the power 4 into 125 raised to the power 11. Now we are provided with 4 options for this question and the options are as follows, A 35, B 36, C 37 and D 38. So this was our question and I would like you to try this question first by yourself and then come to this video for the solution. I hope that you have tried the question and you have got the solution and if you didn't then let's check the solution. So according to a given question we are provided with the number 1024 raised to the power 4 into 125 raised to the power 11. Now we have to find the number of digits in this number. Now it seems a bit tricky number and we have to find the number of digits but how to find it? Now the only method for finding out the number of digits is by using the method of logarithm and if we are provided with the number a raised to the power b into c raised to the power d into e raised to power f and so on and so forth then the number of digits in it will be equal to b log a in the greatest integer function plus d log c in the greatest integer function plus so on and so forth and we have to add plus 1 to it. So by using this very formula we can find out the number of digits in any given number. So by help of this formula let's find out our answer. So according to the formula if we'll put it we'll get greatest integer value of 4 log 1024 plus greatest integer value of 11 log 125 plus 1 as our answer. Now we have to just calculate the value and we will get our answer. Now we know that log 0 1 2 4 can be written as log 2 raised to power 10 and log 2 raised to power 10 is equal to 10 log 2. So we will eventually get 40 log 2 in the greatest integer function and log 125 can be written as log 5 cube and we can also write it as 3 log 5. So we will eventually get 33 log 5 in the greatest integer value and then we'll have to add 1 to get our final result. So putting the values in the greatest integer function, we'll get 40 into 0 0.301 in the first greatest integer function and we'll get 33 into 0.69 in the second greatest integer function and you must remember to add 1. Now when you solve this, you'll get 12 as the value and when you solve this, you'll get 23 as the value and we have to add 1. So finally, we'll get 12 plus 23 plus 1 that is equal to 36. So the given number has 36 digits and according to a given option, it is option number B. So our final answer is option number B, 36. That was all for this video and I hope that you understood all the topics covered in this video. And if you have any doubt, then you can post your doubts down in the comment section or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official Instagram or Facebook page and we will surely solve your doubt as soon as possible. Or you can go to the official website of ASN Academy and you can send your doubts to us from there and all the links are provided down in the description. And if you did like the video then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel ASN Academy.